Oh. Is he really going to go in there? Oh my god. <laughs> He's one bro son of a bitch. Oh shit, there's a copy. Is he going to bite a nose? Oh no, that's shit. Ay, Dios mío. How am I not dead? Why is there compies everywhere? How many did they breed? <laughs> oh, she's going to find her pack and there's not going to be shaving cream in it and she's going to freak out. He left me alone. Idiotas. Yeah, I'm sure Billy's around here somewhere. What if... Billy's one of them pulled me out of there. Oh, God. Not sure I'd do the same. She is not a pleasant person, is she really? Let's face it. What's this? Looks like I was only out for a little while. The embryo should be okay for now. <laughs> well, you'd say that, but they're not there. Where's the cane? Yeta, no, no, no! No, no, no! <laughs> no, no, please, please, no. I'm boss. Looking for this? Uh huh. That's mine! <sighs> you know, this takes me back. I learned to shave with this stuff. Give it back! Now! I'm all out of shaving cream myself. You mind if I borrow some? Stop shaking it! But you're supposed to shake it before you use it. Says so right on the can. You want to tell me what's so important about shaving cream? Or do I ask Inja? <sighs> um... Embryos, be careful. Embryos! Dinosaur embryos. If you drop them, they'll be destroyed. Embryos, huh? Wow. I knew you were up to something, but this, this is pretty clever, I gotta admit. InGen's gonna love me for bringing this back. Talk about a bonus. Look, Yoder. Billy, right? Maybe we can make a deal. This ought to be good. Shoot. Shoot. What should we do? I kind of don't want her to be like victorious in this um, so I'm gonna threaten him because I don't think he'll take that well be back right now or else hmm he's not so tough I don't want to hurt you but I'll do whatever <laughs> it takes to get those embryos you won't be safe until I get them back you're in no position to make threats doll See, I'm kind of on Billy's side here, so I don't really like controlling their conversation is a bit odd. Um, big guy. Maybe you're here. in that tree for a reason. Your bodyguard isn't here right now, is he? Why don't you come down and we'll see who wants that can the most? Oh, that's cute. But kicking your butt won't do me any good if some damn dinosaur gets the drop on us. It's true. It's true. It's safe up there, maybe. Come on, Except he's like convenient your biting height. Gone, you're separated. Do you really want to spend all your time watching me? We could work together. I ain't scared of you. I know. But you no, make a point. No, Billy. Okay. No. Keep talking. Oh. There's a lot of money in it God. for you if I get those embryos to my contacts before they go bad. They're valuable. Those embryos are worth over a million. That's U.S. dollars. I have a buyer. I just need you to take us there, and we'll both be rich. Oh, yeah, right. Like, InGen isn't <laughs> gonna shine a light on an independent contractor like me when they figure out the crown jewels are missing. No sale. Good one, Billy. You stick with InGen. How much does InGen pay you to risk your life? How long before they replace you after you lose a leg or break your back and can no longer jump out of helicopters for hey, them? Don't you worry about it. I get paid plenty to do what I do. You turn that Come on, Billy, to stick to your guns. You get a pat on the back, maybe a little Christmas bonus. You leave it to me, you become a rich man. Pay off your debts, quit your job. No more guys in suits telling you what to do. Just think about it. Come on, Billy. Don't do it, Billy. Money's good, and you won't have to worry about me causing problems. Everybody gets a little something. Don't do it, Billy. Okay, here's the deal. One. I'm in charge. I keep the embryos, and as soon as it's safe to break away, we will no. deliver them to your contact. What are you doing? I don't know if the embryos will last in there much longer. That's a risk we're gonna take. Two, 
We're cutting Oscar in. Why? Because he's my partner, that's why. It'll be fine. Trust me. Oh, now, Billy. Sit tight and lighten up. Not every woman gets to enjoy the sunset on a tropical island with Billy Yoder. <laughs> what? <laughs> what is he? What's around? It's getting dark again. So, any oh, idea God. where we are in back relation with, to the rest of the, the raptors? We're not far from the marine exhibit. I know for a fact that the phone there is in the working marine order. Exhibit. Or at least it was this morning. Does that mean underwater dinosaurs? I believe so. Mm. All right then, lead the way. I want to get us out of here as soon as possible. No more science projects, okay? I understand. I understand. Okay, so what's on the these? Uh, what? Uh, hmm. Corridors. Don't worry, Jess. We should be safe in here. Where do all these doors lead? The maintenance corridors. The park's essential systems are in there. Uh, electrical, water, air conditioning, you know, that sort of thing. The tunnels on this side are for transporting animals, personnel, and food. That's why they're so big. They are separate from the maintenance side to prevent accidents. Okay, so what have we got? A radio show to, to her, the going the right way. Why, why aren't you chief? What kind of question is that? How? You chief. So, Laura, I've been meaning to ask you. Why don't you do your radio show anymore? You had a radio show? Well, it wasn't really radio. I'd hack into the park intercom and play choice cuts from my record collection. Lately, I haven't had the time. Did you really have to show Artie Bridges how to do it? Believe me, I regret it. But how was I to know how bad he was? He begged me, said it was his dream to be in radio. You know what, he should stick to managing the janitorial group. He's <laughs> awful. He certainly is. Is it gonna get eaten by a rat? Oh my god! <laughs> it was just a dream. He actually records his show ahead of time so that he can broadcast during work hours. Did you guys hear that? Sounded like a rat. Mm-hmm. Dinosaurs yeah. aren't the only invasive species InGen brought to the island. There are lots of rats in these tunnels. Lots Maintenance of rats. is always setting traps down here. That wasn't that wasn't no that was no rat. That was a dinosaur head. Why aren't you chief? Why aren't you chief? Are you sure we shouldn't head to the visitor center, Dr. Sorkin? InGen is bound to start there when they don't hear from the rescue team. These tunnels don't run all the way to the visitor center. And I don't know about you, but I'd rather not risk any more overland travel. Good point. It's not much safer down here. Why aren't you chief? Well, as long as we're getting no one another, how is it that Dr. Wu became chief geneticist over you? That's an easy one. Frogs. Frogs. You're saying frogs kept you from getting promoted? Specifically, their DNA. Before we could clone any dinosaurs, we had to decide how to fill in the gaps in the DNA sequences we found. Okay. I remember this from the tour. You found dino blood inside mosquito fossils, right? That's right. I wanted a complete prehistoric genome, cross-referencing all of the DNA found in the various amber samples. It would have been safer. But would have taken would have time the board of directors impossible. didn't want to spend. Well, even Dr. Hammond's spare no expense philosophy has limits, I guess. Exactly. Henry, <laughs> Dr. Wu, proposed us. using frog DNA to fill in the gaps. It was risky. We still don't know all of the effects. But it was a solution, and a fast one at that. So Henry became chief geneticist, and I took to the field. Aww. Has anyone seen my cigarettes? I could swear I had some. <laughs> the raptor's probably smoking them by now. I didn't realize you smoked. Normally I manage to duck out a few times a day, but we've been preoccupied. Where did you last have Duck out? You've been outside right for like the last hour. So I thought. Maybe they fell out when we jumped from the water tower? I suppose. Why is this a plot point? Oh well, I'm probably oh, better off with that. Oh shit. Jess? What are you doing? What are you doing, Jess? Oh my god. She stole them, didn't she? Happy. What was the second word? I missed it. Do you mind if we stop for a rest? My legs are killing me. I suppose we could all use a break. I don't okay. know how much longer those embryos will last. We need to meet my contact at the boat. For God's We're staying sake. here until Oscar gets back. We don't even know if he's alive. Oscar's fine. He's coming back. And come hell or high water, we are not leaving. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Billy, stay still. Then again, maybe you have a point. 
Come on, we gotta run! No time! Hide. Just stand still, it won't do anything. Oh shit, I need to press buttons here. <laughs> it's been so long since I actually had to do anything. <laughs> oh! Eaten. It's gonna get eaten. It can't see you unless you move. Oh, the big bug on his head. That's horrible. Ugh. Come on, it's obviously got. It's obviously preoccupied with other things at the moment. I'm pretty sure it's not a problem. Oh shit, I've messed that up. It's really gonna get eaten now. <laughs> Can only end well. You see, yummy, <laughs> yummy helicopter. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> uh, I admit I did that on purpose. I want to see what happened. <laughs> I forgot how to do the focus mind thing. Do you use a mouse? Oh, you use the mouse, yeah. Stupid. Oh god, I can't, I can't, oh, come on. Oh, damn it, that's hard, that bit. Woo! Okay, Billy, this time, this time. I'm just gonna have to dodge this thing. Ooh! Ah, run, 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 damn it. Uh-oh. Hello? Run! <laughs> oh god. Leaving now! <laughs> Shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I need to get better at this uh, button pressing. I'm not quick enough. What are you doing, Jess? What's going on? She's acting real strange. Oh, hello. <laughs> We're literally being stalked here. Care for a lysine supplement? No, thanks. Oh. What? You know what? Actually, you know what? Maybe I will. All this running around, my muscles probably need whatever protein I can give them. My thoughts exactly. Weird. I haven't gotten this much exercise since Carnival. I Carnival. guess we've got a lot of extra lysine now that the parasaurs don't need the external supply. Yeah, uh, about that. It's not just the parasaurs. Oh, we added you... the antidote to the main water supply. Oh, for God's sake. That'll reach every dinosaur in the park. The lysine contingency... Well done. You're insane! Denying <laughs> the dinosaurs lysine was the only safety mechanism we had to keep them out of the global ecosystem! Oh my god, she's... She's a... She's a lunatic. Um... The <laughs> ecosystem will adjust, yeah, right! Um... Okay. Do I need to remind you that there are 120 miles of ocean between Isla Nublar and the mainland? The Lysine contingency was cruel and unnecessary. <sighs> well, I can swim now, it's dumb. Um, pterodons, that's true. Um, which one do I pick? This one. Yes, the ocean provides a natural barrier, but how can you guarantee InGen won't move some of these dinosaurs to a less isolated place? Look, I'll tell InGen all about this when we get off the island. They can make an informed decision about if and where they want to move any dinosaurs. And the pterodons? Tell me yeah. this. Did you reverse the lysine contingency with the pteranodons? No. Pteranodons. My formula targets superorder dinosauria exclusively. What? If I tried to account for the pteranodons, I might have affected other reptiles. Oh, at least there's that. Now that I think about it, though, targeting only pteranodons, or any one species, would be a simple change. I wouldn't even need a full lab. Am I going to have to ask Jess to follow you into the ladies' room? Oh, it won't sake. come what? to that. If I decide to do it, I won't sneak around and I won't involve you. I'm sorry if the way I went about it last time upset you. Well, thanks for the apology, I guess, because it's about me. <laughs> they can't swim that far. That's a stupid question. Do you know for question. a fact that none of these animals can swim? Oh, come on, Jerry. It's how Asian elephants migrated to Sri Lanka from India. There's precedent. You're being ridiculous. There's no evidence sauropods were swimmers. None.
You see them in the field every day. Have you ever even seen one of our dinosaurs try to swim? We keep them in cages, Laura. They don't get the chance. I know this, more quadrupeds can swim than can't. All right. I'll concede that it's possible there are sauropods that can swim. I'm never going to swim 120 miles away. I still believe that 120 away. miles of open <laughs> water is an effective barrier. Oh, God. The remote possibility that a dinosaur could make it to the mainland is far outweighed by our responsibility to treat these animals humanely. They're here because of us. To be fair, she doesn't know that they can breed yet. Look, let's just agree to disagree for now. But I'll have to tell InGen when this is all over. I understand. Are you guys done yet? Jess, where'd you go? Just down the hall looking at stuff. Not that you noticed, I was gone. I'm sorry, honey, I was distracted, but don't go off again like that, okay? Yeah, okay. Why is she so grumpy? <laughs> oh dear, okay. What's next? 